Hey guys, Bookworm CB1 here, and today I'm here with a voiceover because I'm looking pretty ratchet tonight, so I didn't really want to show myself. But I'm here with a Fall into Winter Room Spiration video, if you didn't see by the title. And I wanted to inspire you guys with how to decorate your room and transition from fall into winter decorations and get you into the Christmas spirit. And this is um, inspired by Stella Babo 9 and MacBaria 7, and I just wanted to show you guys what I did to redecorate my room. So yeah, let's get with it. Sorry if there was an awkward pause, but this is the top of my bureau and up top here I just have this sunflower um, headband and I thought it was nice to have because it was yellow. And I have this funky pumpkin that I got for free and it has a little wire at the top because I thought that would be fun to add. Then down here is my pumpkin pecan waffle candle and from Bath & Body Works and it smells so good. Then this little pumpkin with a wire I got for free and an oyster. And then this um, little scent pot melting thingy with November rain in it and it has leaves on it. Then this little spider ring I thought would be fun to have to add over there. Then I have pumpkin caramel latte and this smells divine from Bath & Body Works. Then another pumpkin with a wire to add a little bit of fall to the room I guess. Then some fake leaves and a Frankenstein foam thing. So, yeah, and then I just have the this gourd and these little dried up flower thingies. And I got, like, all my gourds and pumpkins for free, which I thought was pretty cool. Here is my accent table from Target, and I just have a mustard rally cloth as a tablecloth. And I also have this little pumpkin bowl with a face and I have little chapsticks in there to make it look like it's filled with candy and I had a bit of trouble getting my hand in there. Then I also have this perfect little miniature pumpkin that I don't know what I will do without it. And here's my Bath and Body Works candle in hot buttered rum and it smells so good and I'm probably going to use it forever and ever and it's a full size. And then I also have my iHome that I charged my iPod with. And then down here is just this funky little pumpkin, and it's white, and it's so cute. He there was my bed, and then here's this textured white pillow, and then that pillow has nothing to do with fall. Then this little teeny one has some fall colors in it, and then there was an awkward pause when I was showing you an overview of my whole bed. Then back there I just have some pillows, and this really isn't that fall until you get to the quilt, and Mac Barbie 07 has a quilt similar to it. But it's textured with little ruffles and it's cream. And then I have this cute little moose that I love and it reminds me of fall because it's just a little moose. People love foxes, but I love my moose, of course. Then I just have this throw that keeps me warm, but it's not really folly. Then I just have this green pillow that I thought would be cute to have during the fall because it's green. And yeah, that's basically it. Right here is the cutest little gingerbread house ever, and then I just have this little snowflake stocking up on my jewelry hand thingamabobber, and then a gingerbread craft guy with a silver pine cone in this mug, and then I just have little sprouts of evergreen or whatever, and a green candle at the bottom of this candle little melter thing, and a big pine cone, and my cranberry chutney Yankee candle votive, and in this bowl I did this DIY of just like pine cones and some little spruce pine tree thingies whatever you want to call them and I have a stocking and this little mouse thing that I made and I have the full-size Bath and Body Works candle and hot buttered rum with a gold ball and like a bell and that stocking then this little puff guy on mahogany teak wood the Bath and Body Works candle with a yellow EOS and a Jesus like little thingy and the snowman mug with a candy cane in it and then these glass cupids and this is going fast. Wow. So here's an overview of what everything looks like. And down here is a stocking and then angels and another stocking and angels on my bureau to jazz it up. With another stocking. I have quite a lot of miniature stockings. And then another one with my name on it. As you can see. And then this little mitten. And I, I think that's the angel Gabriel. And then there's Mary and Joseph over on my mirror. Like, I have drawers under my mirror, so those are on there. And then the donkey that carried them. And a random sheep with a purple bow. Then I have my luminescence, luminescence candle and sugar cookie. And it was a dollar at the dollar store. 
And here I am having trouble lighting my candle with just this green lighter. I'm going to show it in like two seconds. Oh, there we go. Okay, and then my Red OS. Then I have my little reindeer craft and this snow globe I made with my friend. And it's in a mason jar and there's a little Christmas tree and a random person with some presents. And yeah. And there is my mold cider mix by Bark and Bradley. And here's my Christmas tree. And I have lots of little ornaments. Here's my Santa. And my candy canes and little snow guy, snowman. What am I saying? What am I saying? Then a star at the top. It's supposed to be gold, but it looks green. And then there's another snowman, a heart, um, a present, a Christmas tree. I couldn't get that in. A gingerbread guy, that present that says Noel. And I have some godchild ornaments down the middle, just saying. And another Santa. And there's an overview of my desk, and that says Merry Christmas. And my coal came in that last year. Ha <laughs> ha. And I have these candles in my window just to light it light up. up. <laughs> Get it? Candle? No? Maybe? Yeah. Okay. Goodbye, guys. Peace.